the hypothetical existence of time-like quasi-particles and the quantization of time would have profound implications for our understanding of the universe, including concepts like dark matter and dark energy, as well as the quest for a unified theory of quantum mechanics and general relativity. The quest for quantum gravity and time travel has led me to pursue the following five axioms. Time as a quantized operator rather than a parameter. Time and space as two three-dimensional quantum fields. Domains of time-like and space-like quasi-particles. Non-unitary evolution possible in the presence of general relativity's closed time-like curves, time loops. Quantum entanglement entropy as a boundary condition for anti sitter space. Time as a quantized operator rather than a parameter. Making time an operator and quantizing it would represent a fundamental shift in our understanding of the universe. Currently, time is treated as a continuous parameter in quantum mechanics and as part of the fabric of space-time in general relativity. The idea of treating time as a quantized operator suggests a departure from the classical description, potentially leading to a new understanding of time's nature and its relation to space. Quantizing time would necessitate a framework where space-time itself is discrete at the smallest scales, potentially resolving inconsistencies between quantum mechanics and general relativity. Especially in extreme conditions like those near singularities in black holes or the early universe. Time and space as three-dimensional quantum fields. Imagining time and space not as the backdrop for events but as entities that are quantized and have their dynamics is a leap toward unifying quantum mechanics with general relativity. In such a theory, space and time would be treated on equal footing, both described by quantum fields. This could lead to a better understanding of the fabric of the universe and the behavior of space-time under extreme conditions, such as near black holes or during the universe's inception. Domains of time-like and space-like quasi-particles. In the context of quantum field theory, particles can be classified based on their relation to the speed of light. Introducing a domain of time-like and space-like quasi-particles as excitations of three-dimensional space and time fields represents a fascinating departure from conventional theories. Introducing quasi-particles, which are disturbances or excitations in a medium that behave like particles, into this framework could allow for novel ways to describe interactions in a quantum gravitational field, possibly shedding light on how space and time interact at the quantum level. These quasi-particles could provide insights into the nature of dark matter and dark energy, mysterious components of the universe that remain unexplained by current theories. By exploring the properties and interactions of these quasi-particles, Scientists could uncover new physics that explains the structure and dynamics of the universe. Non-unitary evolution possible in the presence of general relativity's closed time-like curves, time loops. Unitarity, the principle that the total probability across all possible outcomes of a quantum system remains constant over time, is a cornerstone of quantum mechanics. However, the introduction of closed time-like curves, as allowed in certain solutions to the equations of general relativity, like Gödel's universe or the Kerr metric for rotating black holes, challenges this principle. Non-unitary evolution could allow for processes where probabilities do not add up to one, reflecting the bizarre causal structures introduced by time loops. This would necessitate a significant revision of quantum theory to accommodate the peculiarities of time travel and causality violations. Quantum entanglement entropy as a boundary condition for anti sitter space. This idea posits that the entanglement properties of a quantum system could directly influence the geometry of space-time, offering a pathway to a unified theory that incorporates both quantum mechanics and general relativity. This idea ties into the holographic principle and the ad slash CFT correspondence, where the boundary of a higher dimensional anti sitter space can encode the physics of a lower dimensional quantum field theory without gravity. Quantum entanglement entropy, a measure of entanglement between parts of a system, could serve as a crucial boundary condition, informing the structure of space-time itself within the bulk of ad space. This approach could provide insights into how space-time geometry emerges from quantum entanglement, offering a pathway to unify gravity with quantum mechanics. <laughs>